The Awakening by Rebecca Withy. In a moment, it happened. As the light of the morning hit Becky's face, the red hue seeping through her closed lids, she woke gently with the feeling of things were somehow different. She wasn't exactly sure what changed her perspective. Was it the turning of a new year? Or the prayer she had said before falling asleep from the wine stupor she'd stumbled into? Was it the night of dancing and celebration that cleared the cobwebs from her mind? Or just the new possibilities the coming year would bring? Becky fluttered her eyes open and took a deep breath, making her think of a dream that still lingered like a fresh memory and one she would most likely never forget. It was a beautiful allegory of where her life had been. The past three years had been a difficult path, represented in the dream as a pilgrimage into the mountains filled with twists, turns, and dark tangled forest. And though the journey was still in progress, she had come to a clearing in the climb where she could see a large patch of blue sky through the trees, as well as the path before her twisting back down the mountain through more patches of brush, jagged rock, and more dark forest. But she could also see beyond where the forest clear and the ocean hit the path, spanning as far as her eye would take her. By the view of the path before her, she knew the journey would continue to be rough. She knew she would stumble and fall, stub her toes and receive more scratches on her face in the descent. However, this time, she would see the injuries as badges of courage instead of just signs of weakness. And she knew that there would eventually be an end to the journey. Becky tried hard to remember her companions that had started with her in the beginning. They had held her hand and told her they would be there for her through thick and thin. But as the forest grew dark and the skies unseen through the thickness of the treetops, they had somehow left her side and she was so focused on the survival and planning of each step that she had forgotten to look for them. Looking around in the dream, she couldn't remember exactly who she was looking for, and it was this thought that was the last to be thought before the sunlight hit her face and woke her from the dream. She took another breath, and as she laid there, replaying the dream in her head, Becky continued the thoughts she was thinking in the dream, and she smiled as she recognized the two friends who had returned to her in this new awakening, faith and hope. And once again, she faced the new day with a wonder that was once forgotten.